Kaden, how's your health and everything? How's how's your spring going? Uh, my health's pretty good actually. Um, I haven't been practicing. I was practicing uh, the beginning of spring ball, kind of getting back into things. Um, I'm kind of dealing with some minor stuff right now, not even knee related. Um, so I'll be back here next next week or in the next couple of days. So um, overall, really excited about you know how how I've come come along um, regarding my my health status and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm excited to get back with guys. Yeah, just sure. excited yeah. to do some football, right? Yeah, for sure. It feels like it's been a long time coming. You know, I don't I don't think I've been more hungry to you know get back and to uh, play with my guys and you know just get back to doing what you know, doing what I love best. Um, just playing football. So yeah, can't be more thankful. How frustrating has this entire experience been, just not being able to stay healthy and get out on the field? I'm not going to lie. It's been probably one of the, the hardest tests in my life. I know God, you know, he has a plan for me. Um, I'm, I'm trying my best, you know, stick to that plan. Um, but, I mean, I can I can kind of find some good out of it. You know, I've, been, I've never been more motivated than I am, more hungry to get back, like I just said. Um, and, you know, I think, I think you know, this, this will really help me um, kind of get a new perspective for things, appreciate what I have for what it is a little bit better. And I think once I fully get back, um, you know, I'm just going to be a different person overall. You also just sick of that a answering the question. How yeah, you I mean, nah, nah, I mean, I get it. You know, um, I was out last season, so obviously there's going to be some questions about it. Um, you know, nothing, you know, it doesn't strike me too much. Um, I just know I'm excited to get back, get, get back with my guys, get back to doing what I love. So. Just watching the tight end group, it seems like that entire room's transformed a little bit. Is it kind of fun knowing that there are opportunities there to get out onto the field? Oh, for sure. I mean, we got a good group of guys, you know, with um, some guys coming in like Bauer, Devon. Um, we got Jake, too. Um, so we definitely got a, a good group of guys coming in, and we all got a good chemistry already. Um, you know, we. You know, talk obviously every day, but you know, outside of football, we got each other's back, stuff like that. So I mean, I would say I'm really excited to see you know how this group is going to perform um, and you know how we're going to attack the season for sure. You mentioned those guys. What stood out to you so far about Devon? Uh, Devon, obviously size. You know, he's a freshman. He looks like you know fifth year senior already. So I mean, Devon, really excited to see what you know he's capable of, and we're already uh, kind of starting to see some of that stuff. So it's good to just like I said, be out there with the guys. Um, and having fun at that. So, you got a great podcast that's going on now, and everybody's yes, talking sir. about it. So, how did that come together? And, and you know, it's, it's still going pretty well. Yeah. So, um, actually, the coach who recruited me at Arizona State, he got out of coaching um, and kind of got into the podcast business stuff like that. So, he hit me up uh, I think two years ago, asked me if I wanted to do a pod, um, if I wanted to be the co-host, and. Then, that's where uh, kind of Nick came in the situation. So we're definitely blessed, bl blessed for it, and you know it's been nothing but nothing but good for us. So. How much has Coach Finley just kind of helped you develop since you've been here in the last couple of years? Oh, I mean, amazing. Man. I mean, before I, before I got here, you know, you kind of think you know you know stuff, but once you really get to college, you understand that you, know, you don't know as much as you do. And Finley's done a really good job of helping me kind of just slow things down and. Um, I know Bauer said this in an interview. He's, he helps us really, like, kind of dumb things down and makes the game just easier for us to understand, basically. Um, you know, that's my guy. You know, he hits me up every week about my health, how, how I'm doing mentally, stuff like that. So I appreciate him for that. From the outside looking in, it would seem with him now being a co-offense coordinator, Seth, I'm sure, loves the fullback, having played it. You guys see yourself? Is it is it different now for you guys? Just your role, just in terms of a tight end with the new offense? Oh yeah, I would say for sure. I mean, it definitely helps having your you know, position coach and offensive coordinator, two guys who play the fullback tight end position. Um, I think I think it'll be a lot, bring a lot of um, diversity to the offense, and we'll definitely see more more tight end involvement this year. Um, and we definitely got the guys to do it, so I'm excited. Caden, what have you seen from Devon Mitchell so far in these first 